Prince Harry and wife Meghan Markle are a very tactile couple and are not afraid to pack on the PDA when out in public, unlike other royal relatives, such as Prince William and Kate Middleton. At the St. Baal Polo 2018 the couple kissed during the awards ceremony, and on their recent outing to Id's house in Chichester the Duke and Duchess of Sussex continued to put on a loved-up display, laughing, joking and touching one another fondly adding to the long list of their cute moments together. But what does their body language say about their relationship and their future as a married couple? TV language and body expert, Judy James, spoke exclusively to OK! Online about Prince George, Prince Louis and Princess Charlotte's aunt and uncle's relationship. Top stories Meghan Markle Prince Harry cutest moments, Duke and Duchess of Sussex's romantic bond the strict royal pregnancy traditions Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will have to follow Meghan Markle reveals how she surprised Prince Harry on their wedding day Judy explain new couples are more tactile with one another early on in a romance, which is often described as the honeymoon phase. She said, Anyone who has ever been deeply in love will identify with the tactile behaviors that Harry and Meghan have shown since they first appeared as a couple. The honeymoon phase of a relationship produces a stage of love known as passionate love, where you can feel incomplete without your partner to touch, cuddle and exchange eye contact with. While the couple are often spotted hand in hand, they occasionally refrain putting their arms around one another so not to break royal protocol. Judy believes, however their desire to be close to one another is hard for the duo to stop. Most popular dancing on Ice 2019 lineup, who are the contestants on the new series? Sandra Redknapp reveals intimate detail that keeps her marriage thriving Brian Delcourt baby, dancing on Ice star baby father and relationship details she said, when Harry and Meghan appear in public in hands off poses. It's probably a reluctant nod to royal protocol. Although you can often see from Meghan's truncated touch gestures, where she might raise a hand towards her husband before dropping it to her side, that the urge to be tactile is a hard one to deny. She continued, it's obvious from Harry and Meghan's PDAs and touch rituals that they are still besotted with one another and deeply in lust as well as love. But do these traits ensure a long-lasting marriage? Judy believes even when Harry and Meghan are not as tactile in public, their subtle glances to one another show their strong connection, which is the secret to an everlasting romance. Judy said, when we touch we speak, and all the hand-holding and eye-checking means Harry and Meghan are able to communicate with one another via the subtlest of glances or hand squeezes in a way that will allow them to keep the vital empathy alive in their relationship. It allows a couple to tune in and read one another's minds or gauge their emotions and this is the real secret to a long-lasting relationship.